It's time for some music here on your Feel Good Breakfast Show. We're joined by Spoken to Chris and Luzon. They're a beautiful married couple. They've been traveling both nationally and internationally, making some incredible music. But right now, we have them right here in our Feel Good studio, and they're about to perform for us with somebody that I used to know. Now and then I think of when we were together Like when you said you felt so happy you could die Told myself that you were right for me But I felt so lonely in your company But that was love and it's an ache I still remember You get addicted to a certain kind of sadness like resignation to the end, always the end. So when we found that we could not make sense, you said that we could still be friends. I'll admit that I was scared that it was over. You didn't have to cut me off, make out like it never happened. I don't even need your love You treat me like a stranger and I feel so rough You didn't have to stoop so long Have your friends collect your records and change your number I guess that I don't need that though Now you're just somebody that I used to know Somebody that I used to know Somebody Just screwed me over Had me believing it was always something I had done I don't want to live that way Reading into every word you say You said that you could let it go But I wouldn't catch you hung up on somebody that I used to didn't have to cut me off Make out like it never happened And that we were nothing I don't even need your love But you treat me like a stranger And I feel so rough You didn't have to stoop so low Have your friends collect your records And change your number I guess that I don't need that though Now you're just somebody that I used to I used to Brilliant, brilliant stuff. Man, Chris and Luzon, what a refreshing cover, man. I've got you as somebody that I used to know. Welcome to Expresso, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, so I want to know, man, like, take us back. How did the two of you find each other uh, in music and then ended up traveling the world and making music? Well... It was a thousand years ago. I've lived in for a thousand, thousand years. years ago, right? Of course, yes. Uh, <laughs> no, well, we, we actually um, found... Uh, we actually met through music at a singing competition. At a singing competition, yeah. really? Yeah. Yeah. About eight years ago, so yeah. yes, it's, it's an old love, but still a new flame. <laughs> but I think that is so great. I mean, now you're married. You're married for how long now? Just a year and a half. A so year and a yes, half. Yes, yes. All right. And I think it's so nice that, you know, as husband and wife, you can enjoy something that you both enjoy and you're able to travel the world with it. And it seems like you guys are really just doing so well together. Like, what is traveling like for you guys? Because I know that traveling puts a lot of uh, pressure that brings a lot of stresses as well on, on, on people. Do you guys ever, you know, you know, do you travel easily together? Yeah, yes, we of do. Course we Getting do. a bit of grey hair has been working very hard together. <laughs> but it's, it's uh, no, it's going very well actually. Um, we're just trying to see as many countries as possible, and just doing what we love, doing music, and at the same time writing music and producing music yeah. at the same time, all at once. All at once. Well, yeah, it seems fantastic. Trying, I mean, uh, literally, the world is your oyster. What is what is the plan for you guys ahead? I mean, talking about the fact that you are traveling, you know, all the way abroad. I mean, in terms of your own music, or do you have your own music at the moment currently? Yes, yes, yes we have. Yeah. We're busy working on our album, and we'll be finishing it in Tahiti. And then 2016 will be the year for us to launch our album, and 
a fantastic year, we hope. Well, I hope you guys are going to come back once you launch your yes, album as well. Yes, of course we are. Yeah, great. So Tahiti, what are some of the most exotic destinations that's, that you guys enjoy traveling in? Uh, Bahamas, oh. and then also Dubai. We've been to Dubai for a year. Yeah, so but we're looking forward yeah. to the Bahamas and just to relax and find, find you know, our, our you know, yeah. inner core and uh, develop our music through that. Yeah. That's it, yeah. Well, well, touring and seeing all the great <laughs> places, yeah. Absolutely. And, and, and just lastly, what is, the, what is the plan once you go into your own music? I mean, what can people expect? What would be your style? Um, who's your inspiration in terms of music? Well, our style is more a uh, modern contemporary. We are actually mixing both Afrikaans and English. Uh, going into both uh, on album, and uh, yeah, our inspiration, uh, my inspiration, I think, is more uh, John Mayer, more bluesy type of style, yeah. and yours would be. Astadio, like I love them. I think they're so chill yeah. and just, you know, human. Yeah. So yeah. Well, I, I love the fact, once again, like I said earlier, the fact that you guys are married, you're traveling together, you're just doing your thing and you're having so much fun doing it as well. We are going to be hanging out with Spoken 2 a little bit later on this morning once again with another killer performance to take us into the state. Don't miss it.